And round 14 takes us to France for the uh, Tour de Course. So, another asphalt rally. Medium difficulty. 13 Ks in length. Let's go. I've clinched the uh, novice title. Fuck it. Again, I really don't have to do uh, continue this because I got everything, but I even got, I think I even got the trophy. But just for the sake of completion, I'm just gonna do it anyways. Because you know why not? I'm an idiot. Why not prolong this LP? Because I'm dumb. You're ready. Here to kick ass and win a Bush Series title. Go, go, go! Oh, a Bush Six Series right. title. Hi, Zero. Your timing sucks because I just finished the Rally Japan. Three right long. Three left. Now we're in France for the tour four course. Flat over crest. Keep right. And four left. What? Yeah, I just Flat finished the six crest. minute weave rally. Oh, oh, oh. Breaking. Uh, how you doing, car? <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's not my fault that your timing sucks, alright? You should have been here ten minutes sooner and you would have been able to watch it. I want to hear it. I do the, do the fucking snap snap thing, but uh, my hands are currently occupied by the uh, driving this car. All out of cheese. Well, that's not very good. Uh. So can't get over the fucking water droplet sound of "Hey, you got a green sector." <laughs> oh no, he's gonna squish. Oh no, he is squished. Fuck. And two right open. He is done the squoosh. Oh shit. Two left, long open. Ah. I've been squooshed. Five right, cut. Five left, short. And four right, flat over crest. My job here is done. Just don't mix, miss the next one, you. Oh, you did yeah, well, You. That was a... Surprisingly, that stage went very well. Put dicks in it. I know I won't punch you in the nose, coward. I hate you! Something, something, Alex Jones. Because he missed the Rally Japan, that's why. Ooh, lobes up on Grunholm. Now we get to uh, pay attention to the uh, freaking battle for second in the championship between Lobe and Grunholm. Since I beat them all. <laughs> God damn it, Zero. Monka TOS. Uh, shit. You're an intellectual dumbass, and I'm coming. But first, I gotta do stage two. I don't know. Let's go. He's gonna come. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, Q. Well, this chat got uh, a lot insane very quickly. Okay, it's been a good season so far. I guess we can take it a little bit easier. I mean, we are, you know, I, I, we have clinched the championship, so yeah, we could take it easy. Go, go, go! Guess what I'm gonna do? Probably not that. I still don't know why all these hairpins are being listed as a two. It's like, bro, it's a hairpin. Don't even try to fool. Oh my god, how did I not hit that hole? 
Grunholm and Solberg were tied in that sector. All right. Very good. Cars deciding is surprisingly deciding to uh, be fairly stable. This rally. That doesn't count as a uh, jinx because that I went off road. So. There's a reason for it to uh, destabilize there. Oh, one of the Subies is out. Oh no. Oh no. Boy, did it tighten up. Oh, there he is. Goodbye. It's probably Sarah's in again. I know it's not a Solberg, that's for sure, so... Honestly, I don't even know if it's Sarazen or Atkinson. What the hell happened there? Random hazard, alright. Every time I have that Nightbot message shows up, because it has my name in it, it fucking highlights in red, and I'm just like, wait, what? Who's saying something to me? Nope. It's just Nightbot. Nightbot doing his job. Good Nightbot. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, that's another... Oh, well, both of them. So, um... He just said close... Was that Solberg? He just said closest rival. That Was that Solberg? Crash into that tree? No, it was not. Okay, it was. Uh, it was. So both Atkinson and Sarazen are out now. Well then, uh, rip. That's all I have to say about that is rip. Also, I won the stage by 21 seconds. Yeah. Oh, high trauma. Damn it! You let him complete the penis. How dare you guys? So, Grunholm and Solberg tied in that stage. <laughs> Alright. They're pretty much like that through the whole stage. But most importantly, Grunholm beat Loeb and uh, increased that advantage by 8 tenths of a second. So, Atkinson out, Sarazen out. Apparently Duval is also out. I didn't see that one. Did that happen in stage 1? I don't know. second there, I thought the game crashed. No, I just didn't press X hard enough. Me stupid. So, with that, Grunholm holds, moves up to second. Loeb moves down to fourth. And, uh... Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. All I can really say is just, hmm, hmm, hmm. A clean up in aisle trauma. Uh, Alright, let's finish... The tour de course with our final stage at four and a half Ks in length. His tears are flying out of his helmet. Now you're the world champion, you can take well, yeah, that is true. I like how there's different voice lines and everything, like, in relation to the championship. They had, they recorded a ton of fucking co-driver lines in this game. I'm, for one, am holy about it. Again, that's probably my favorite thing about this game, so far from my experiences. They gave the co-driver an actual personality. Instead of just, you know, being the person who tells me where to go, he like he actually has a personality. That is the true evolution of this game. We need more. We need every rally game needs needs this. I was gonna say we need more rally games like that has a co-driver like this, but no, all of them need this. Anyways, Tarmac Special's driving through. How you do? 
Oh. There's a Ford out, and co-driver is very happy about the Ford being out. Okay. He's also an asshole at times, like celebrating other cars retiring. Save that. That's that's not something I save in this game without assists. Fuck. Yo, God. That was a tight as fuck chicane right there with the building. Smash into the finish That's board, why not? Fuck it up. Alright, well, um... That was a very dominant rally. I actually didn't die, like, pretty much at any part in that rally, which is... Very surprising. To me. Very surprising. Meanwhile, in terms of the battle between Loeb and Grunholm, uh, Loeb wins this round because Grunholm had a shitty stage. Whoops. I was Roman Crested, that was the Ford that retired there. Alright. Cool. Not cool, but unfortunate. So, victory for me. By nearly a minute in a 7-8 minute rally. You know, as I do. Solberg takes second, but most importantly, Loeb beats Grunholm this time, but he only gains one point because they were third and fourth instead of second and third, so Loeb's still one point behind Grunholm. We also had four retirements in this rally, good god. Lordy lordy. Alright, well. Another trophy, another set of 300 unlock points for me. Ugh. You didn't save, or did I? I didn't. You know what I will do? I will save after we look at the point standings. Which, here are the updated point standings, so how many points I have is irrelevant. I've already won the title, whatever. What matters is this battle between Grunholm and Loeb for second. Of which Grunholm is now leading by only one point with two rounds to go. So, uh... Shit's intense, man, between those two. Oh my god, I didn't even notice Gianluigi luigi finished 8th. He finally is on the board. He did it. Now we just need passing in to fucking score a point. He's the only other driver to has score a point yet. Yeah, to have not scored a point. So... Jean-Luigi Mario. Mario. Anyways, manufacturer standings, pretty much got that wrapped up. I don't think, like, mathematically we do, but we pretty much do. It's 35 point lead over Peugeot now. Increased from 7 from, from the last round, so... There's that. Let's move on to the penultimate round of the Novice Championship.